Okay, so unless you've lived in Bermuda the past month or so, you know about the Ice Bucket Challenge that's happening to raise awareness for ALS. However, as terrible a disease as ALS is, there is a much worse disease out there, and it's called sin. Sin has ravaged our world more than any disease known to man. It has taken more souls than any war in history. If you take every war in history combined and add up all the, all the people who died, it doesn't come close to how many people have become victims of sin. And so I'm starting a new challenge called the Ice Bucket Baptism Challenge. And here's how it works. In order to stop the ravaging disease of sin, we must spread the word of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ suffered, bled, and died on a cross so that we may be saved from our sins. And in case you think you're not a sinner, you are. There's not a single one of us who isn't. Read Romans 3. There is none righteous, no, not one. Only God is righteous. And only Jesus Christ can set us free from our sins. So here's how this challenge is going to work. I challenge three people. I'm going to challenge Joe Dewart of the Evangelism Guys. I'm going to challenge Pastor Stephen Wilson of the Baptist Church in Romney, West Virginia. And I'm going to challenge Ray Comfort of Living Water Ministries to take this ice bucket slash baptism challenge. And you can either, the way, the, it's sort of the way the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge worked. You can either uh, have an ice bucket dumped on your head, sort of symbolizing a baptism, or what you can do is you can spread the gospel to nine people that you know. All right, Joseph, douse me. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's your turn. <laughs>